Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyana Muhammad. Wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam. Amma ba'd. It's imperative to keep the momentum of fasting up. That although Ramadan is coming to an end, and we hope that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has blessed us to gain benefit and increased us in iman and taqwa Allah azza wa jal, that we want to keep up this, this momentum. And that's why usikum wa nafsi bi taqwa Allah azza wa jal, that I urge you and urge myself first and foremost to fear Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and strive your best to continue fasting for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Fast the extra fast to prepare you for the next Ramadan if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala blesses you with that opportunity to make it to the next Ramadan. An Abdullah ibn Amr ibn As ibn As رضي الله تعالى عنه قال قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم صوم ثلاثة أيام من كل شهر صوم الدهر كله متفق عليه. In this hadith that was collected in Bukhari and Muslim by Abdullah ibn Amr ibn As رضي الله تعالى عنهما he said that the messenger of Allah صلى الله عليه وسلم said Fasting three days from every month is like fasting the whole year. And this is collected in Bukhari and Muslim. Encouraging us to fast. Fast the, the, the extra fast. Strive your best to gain that taqwa. You know, and, and make dhikr of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala throughout the whole year. Don't let Ramadan just be the only time. And that's advice first and foremost to myself and then to, to you. Strive your best to gain the benefit from Allah Azza wa Jal. And we ask that Allah the Almighty accepts our good and forgives our evil and protects us from every kind of evil. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help the Muslims everywhere and bless the Muslims everywhere and forgive the Muslims everywhere and guide the Muslims everywhere. And may Allah unite our hearts based on Kitabillah, wa sunnah Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive us of our sins and bless us to complete Ramadan and bless us to gain benefit from Ramadan and our taqwa Allah azza wa jal. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.